Man, this day is going quick. It's already 10.45 already. I've already been up for almost six hours. Alarm went off at, uh, well, a motorcycle for sale. That'd be pretty cool. Alarm went off at five o'clock this morning. Went to a 5.30 workout kickboxing today. Just leaving my parents' office. Um, and now I'm on my way to a student, uh, an outdoor student. Um, which I feel like I, I explained last time. Like I told myself I wasn't gonna go back to giving per, like in-person lessons. But two Sundays ago, I had reached out to a, that parent and I was like, hey, I just wanna see if there's any like thing that I could do to make the experience better for your child. And the not parent was like, actually, she's really struggling with in-person lessons. And I'm like, oh, sorry, with online lessons, we're gonna have to do in-person. I was like, uh, well, I wasn't expecting that kind of response. But, <laughs> so I'm like, well, maybe we can do, um, you know, bi-weekly. And I'm like, uh, uh, that's what I said. And she's like, uh, no, it has to be weekly in person. I'm like, uh, okay. <laughs> So that's where I left off with them. I'm like, no, I'm not in this weird position now because I'm like, oh, do I like either I say, okay, we're I'm stopping lessons because I'm only doing, you know, in person uh, online, or I continue and I don't know. So I'm continuing, but it's all good, all good. That lady's been sitting. There was a lady sitting down there stupid. She's been sitting there for the past almost looks like probably two and a half, three hours, maybe two and a half hours. I gotta say that I really wish that I could just spend my time making music like all the time and. And even like like um, performing that music live in front of people and stuff, but like I'm really not a big fan of the product, like the the promotion of the stuff. Like I don't know, it's just I don't know. I would much rather just make the music. Alrighty then, you want to talk about analytics? <laughs> Let's see. I uh, this obviously page views, page RPM. I don't know what RPM. It's rate per maybe. So M is thousand impressions. So I believe like CPM is cost per thousand impressions. But I don't know RPM. Impressions is over here. Clicks is over here. Cost per click, I guess that is. And CTR, click through rate, page click through rate. That's pretty. Oh no, no. I thought it was. I thought it was nineteen percent. I'm like, oh, that's cool. But no, it's two point five. All right, we could work on that click through rate. I think. This is pretty cool. Look at this. 296, that is my all time rate that I've made so far with these Google ads on on my page. That's pretty cool. I mean, this. so if I look at it, um, in May, I made $19.13. Well, I guess we can do that, I can show you guys this. In May, I made 19.13. In June, I made 81, here it is, 81.25. Then in, July, I made 196. What was going on in July? That's pretty sick. And then August is not finished yet. That's pretty cool. I'll take that. I'm, I'm grateful. Thank you very much. That's pretty cool. How come places like phone places and, um, you know, internet places, they always try to add these extra fees that they hope you don't catch. I was just looking at my, my, vi my, bu my bill for, for Wi-Fi and I'm seeing that for the past four, five, six months, they they charged a uh, um, an eight dollar fee for a service protection fee, which is like if anybody, if you ever need service, it's free. But I never signed up for that, so how did that end up on my account? All right, just wrap, finished wrapping up a. Uh, a client job. I haven't had much of those lately. Um, this one was for a while ago when I did the, that photo shoot for those products. Um, now I was updating their website with those those updated products. Um, but yeah, so I'm grateful for the opportunity to do that. Uh, it was a little tedious uh, just because like it was having to drag files over, upload, refresh the page. And I'm trying to figure out, still trying to figure out why they're cart isn't working like you can't put your credit card in there and stuff like that the back end of tech stuff makes me want to put my eyeballs all out of my socket so <laughs> definitely not my strong suit visiting my sister's apartment in queens uh they moved in about a month ago and uh it's the first time that i was able to actually see it um really cool apartment you know it has total city vibe it's really cool really it's actually high ceiling it's really nice and spacious apartment but on the way home i like i, I was thinking about how you know, I'm so used to seeing all these things around here, you know, like the city, the Long Island Expressway, um, 
you know, my neighborhood. And it just amazes me that you guys watch this and you could be in a, from a completely different part of the world and how I'm curious what your area looks like and what the day-to-day -day that you see every day looks like. And it just got me thinking, like, I think it'd be cool. Uh, from, I think I might send a text down and be like, look, I want to see, I want you to vlog for a day and send me the video because I'd love to see what your day looks like, what your area looks like, what your hometown looks like. Uh, it'd just be cool to see, you know, if you're in India or if you're in, in England or if you're in California or if you're in Canada, you know, just what your hometown, what your area, what your life looks like. I think it'd be really cool. So I don't know. It's a thought. I guarantee it's going to be the same thing. Out to dinner, catching up with an old friend. At the table.